dear children we are going to see about properties of integers now let us see closure property of integers on addition if we add two positive integers we get a positive integer if we add two negative integers we get a negative integer if we add a positive and negative integer the answer may be positive or negative or zero we consider plus 7 and plus 4 we add them let us use multi purpose board to check this addition see on top we have seven positive symbols down we have four positive symbols add all together the result is 11 positive symbols so plus 7 plus plus 4 is equal to plus 11 if we add two negative integers we get a negative integers let us consider four negatives and three negatives four negative symbols are located and three negative symbols are placed let us add all the symbols we get seven negative symbols this is an addition of integers when we add four unit of negatives with three unit of negatives we get total seven unit of negatives thus we conclude if we add two negative integers we get a negative integer now we place seven negative symbols and four positive symbols when we add seven unit of negatives with four unit of positives we get total three units of negatives because the negative numbers are high so the answer is just a negative number four positive unit cancels with four negative units so when we add seven unit of positives with four unit of negatives we get total three unit of positives four positive symbols and four negative symbols and adding them one positive and one negative get cancel likewise all four positives get cancel with all four negatives so we get four positive unit cancels with four negative units the result is zero a boy says he earned 4 rupees and another boy says he spent 4 rupees so the result is a boy says he earned 4 rupees after some time he spent that 4 rupees so finally he has nothing in his hand so plus 4 and minus 4 give zero because the positive number and the negative numbers are equal so the result on addition is zero if we had a positive and negative integers the answer may be positive or negative or zero thus we conclude we observe that in all the above cases the sum of two integers is an integer this property is known as closure property of integers on addition now let us see this words 2 in a pair and 4 in a group flying together and totally there are six birds next we see four birds flying first and followed by two birds so after some time 4 plus 2 these six birds flying together so 
it states that 2 plus 4 is equal to 4 plus 2 which is equal to 6. Thus, we conclude a plus b is equal to b plus a. Addition of numbers is commutative. Now, let us check this using multipurpose board. We consider minus 4 and plus 2 in the board. So, adding minus 4 and plus 2, we get minus 2. Similarly, plus 2 added with minus 4, the result we get minus 2. So, even if we take a positive integer and negative integer, it satisfies commutative property on addition. Now, let us consider two negative integers minus 5 and minus 3. Let us add minus 5 plus minus 3 gives us minus 8. Similarly, minus 3 and minus 5 on addition we get minus 8. So, addition of integers is commutative. Now, we see plus 5 and plus 3. Plus 5 and plus 3 gives the result plus 8. Similarly, on the other side, plus 3 and plus 5 gives the same result plus 8. Thus, 5 plus 3 is same as 3 plus 5. This property is known as commutative property on addition.